G'day. This is part three of the balcony bonsai. So all of these trees are in training to become bonsai. This is a silver birch. This is one of a lot of 20 bare root saplings I got off eBay. So I've actually got a couple more here. Let me get them. So these were the nicest ones I kept and the other ones, <coughs> so the other ones I've sold, I've sold on. So these are them. This is going to be their third year of growth. This one last year just grew like mad. <laughs> Shot up. As you can see, it's got a really nice twist in it. Nice bend there. Might be too much of a bend. The pigeons keep landing on the balcony. Can you do? It's another one here. Also, heaps of growth. Cuts it right back. That's the new leader there. I think in time, that's going to be a really nice silver birch. And this one here, the largest one, and if you can see the light, it's a bit poor. Um, it's starting to silver up a bit, which is really nice. And it's got some nice, quite nabari there as well. Yeah, could be a nice tree in the future. There's the other one. The one's also started to silver up, you can see. Love it, love it. And this one's already coming to leaf. These are the small leaf variety of silver birch. Here we got an orange dream maple. I got this for Christmas from my son. It was just tall and straight and boring. This is from Aldi. What was it? I don't know what it, whatever it cost. Christmas present. I think, yeah, orange dream. Put a nice bit of twist into it. Yeah, that could be nice in the future as well. Yeah, we've got a pomegranate. I've had this for about five years now. Very slow growing. And they're very brittle. Over there, I snapped it. You can't really put much of a bend into these kind into this wood, it just snaps. Got some nice gnarly roots going on there. Let's see how this one goes. Don't know if it'll make it much longer. Yeah, we've got a Chinese elm. This is seven years old. Been cut right back. Quite a thick uh, trunk on it. Nice bit of nabari there. Oh, knock it over. Nice nabari there. Yeah. Well, this one had a terrible knuckle on it. I had to cut it right back with the concave pruner. Cut it right back. And now, I think it'll actually look all right. It had this massive knuckle. I just couldn't live with that knuckle, so I cut that off. That should be good. And the last one is a mystery tree. This tree I dug out of... Where was it? Highways England. I was working and it was growing in the gravel there. I asked the guy if I could take it when I was working there, doing some maintenance. And he said, yeah, sure, help yourself. So I can't remember what the name of this tree is, but it's getting some kind of a bud thing on it there. Doesn't look like a leaf. Maybe someone to know in the comments what kind of tree it is. But anyway, I've put a nice bit of shape into it. Give a nice tree in the future. Anyway, thanks for watching. Cheers.